See, this is where I really need quick travel now. It's like, all right, let's get us back to the plane of knowledge. Nope, got to run. <laughs> Maybe I should just buy a mount, but how am I... Get, how did I... Did I... Think... How did I get a mount? How did I get the familiars? Did they come through mail? I just need a horse. Where am I at? Right, right there. Yeah, see, he's got a lot more. Dang it, I hate when I do that. A lot more stuff showing up on here. Quick book. Thank you for that information. Let me see something here. So I went to Familiars and they were free. It's so got beasts. Oh, there's the Prowlers. Looks the same in NeverQuest 2. How about that? That's kind of... So what did I... I got... What did I get? Uh, oh, they got... Oh, oh I got a little jet pack. <laughs> uh, horses. So you don't have the unicorns here, huh? A trollish heritage crate. No, thank you. Say Pegasus. Say I got. Did I get the unicorn? I think I got the unicorn, didn't I? I think I got the unicorn in EQ too. So maybe I'll have to get a Pegasus here. Ooh. Oh. Of course you're two thousand. Not that I can't afford it. Yeah, see, yeah, see, they're they're all two thousand except for the normal guy. Oh my god! So I can ride a dragon for a thousand. Oh, the snow puma. Should I get the snow puma? I don't know. That's cheap. But this one, twenty five hundred, huh? I may have to go for the Pegasus. I might go for the Pegasus then. Blazing. Ah. I he's got red and white. I mean, there are RMG gaming colors, but I don't know if I'm digging that one entirely. <coughs> I kind of like this one, the Celestial one. We're buying him. Complete the purchase. Boom. Okay. We got him. Now, where do we have him? That's the question. There he is. Okay, that's right. He went directly into inventory. Let's throw him down here. Hold on. Now, how do I summon my mount? Just click on it. Oh, there he is. Oh, look how. Ooh. Dang it. Now. now, can I? Yeah, see, they don't. Can I go there? Say I can't add anything to my skill bars, which is annoying. This can I add this one here? No? No? That's alright. Uh 
That's one cool looking Pegasi there. Pegasus. Alright, good. We got our mount. Let's, uh. And he flaps his wings. Is he, f he flies! Oh, he really flies. <laughs> oh, watch out for the trees. Alright, I don't want to get anywhere where I can't get back out. So that looks like a dead end there. Can I can I go up? Can I go higher? Can I make them go higher? They're flying over the trees. Look, he just floats gently down. Like that. All right, I gotta figure. Where am I? I gotta figure out. Cause now I just gotta follow the cavern so we can get back to. Uh, where's the book here? Right, that's where I want to go. Thank you. So we'll just follow this. See if I can get him to fly higher. He was getting up over the trees. Well, I'd say that that uh, the leftover station cash from the good old Vanguard days is uh, coming in handy now. Oh, look at that. Oh, my good. Oh, oh you, you can stop now. Here we go. <laughs> you like that? So we got a unicorn and we got Pegasi. Oh, turn here. Stop. Oh, I got to wait. All right. Never mind. Go away. Let's just click the book. All right. Let's get back to the plane of knowledge. I think what I want to do, because we do need to level here. Yeah, because actually I have not leveled up yet. We got to go fight some beasties here. Did I not click the book? There we go. No, killing unicorns does not sound like fun. There's only one left, you know. Or at least so, uh, so I've heard, even though they made three movies out of it. I think, didn't they make three movies? The Last Unicorn? Isn't it a trilogy or something now? I think. Alright, here we go. Unicorn and the Pegasi. Alright, there we go. Alrighty then. Do I, can I fly in here? Well, first things first, what I need to do, I need to, all right, let's go, so I, we'll keep with the default maps, except for the ones that don't have map packs, just to keep it a little bit more cleaner here. Um, oh, I can do find right from here. I want to find zone, actually, I do want to find these quests, don't I? Uh, is any of these guys close? Now why wouldn't I? Alright, let's go find this guy. It's not too far off. We got Pegasus coming through.
So you hail. Uh, starts a bit when you hear he has a pensive look on his face as he speaks. Hello, mortal. No, wait. The proper greeting is hail. Hail, mortal. For greeting you, I am unfamiliar with your rules as I've never been to your realm before and have never met a mortal. Oh, so you just popped in right now just as I came along? Because there's mortals all around. Never met a mortal. All right. Oh, I am not unique that way. As few of us have, your kind are considered crude, dull, and violent by the Jan. Most mortals appear to be too stupid to gain access to the planes by any of the normal methods. Uh, speak of our people to you, and you've not earned the right to. The why? Then why? Why was I able to click on it? Seriously. <laughs> oh my God! Normal methods. All right. Then don't make it clickable if I'm not going to learn nothing. <laughs> uh, I will not assault your mind with the description of our rules. Your mind is not capable of understanding them. See, I don't like you already. Uh, grieving soul sent. Oh, it's a scent, no less. Blanks. Or there are ways that you can. There is a way you can earn your way. Oh, really? Okay. Earn. About your greed as well. Yeah, I'm not I'm not stupid, but not smart enough to learn anything, right? Uh, counting on that as well. So I'm, sure all, I need, I'm here to recruit soldiers. Perhaps defeat the Efreeti. Push them back out of Stratos. Then I won't offer you something rare for a mortal. Access to the John realms. You must. Uh, all you must do is gain uh, is to help defeat the Efreeti. Must state that your access will be brief, lasting no longer than the required uh, to win this foolish war. Okay, you have a lot to say now. Through Mubbis something. Uh, I've already lost Urn, Stratos. Normal method, Stratos. What's Stratos? Okay. Alright, so we got that. Uh, I did Rare, which brought me here. Foolish War. Uh, the, and not, uh, I need your, uh, I need you to uh, accept. Ah, uh, okay, so this is an expansion quest. All right, well, never mind then. All right. I think I, I, I only don't have two expansions. All right. I think the most two recent expansions are the only ones I don't have. Figures. All right, um. All right, so, all right, at least, at least in James the Watchmaker. Are you kidding me? Of course he's way back there at the last portal. <laughs> Freaking killing me. Of course he's way back there. <laughs> Son of a... All right, let's go see where this last guy is. Mika Garn. You're over by the bank. So I probably talked to you already. Alright, so... Alright, that's the... Oh. So let's, 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 let's go see if you've got anything for us. If you're going to shun us too. Oh, okay, so I can't move the map and find. All right. Well, let's go. Fly, Pegasi, fly. Oh, there you are. Maybe i not then. Probably didn't even notice you, which is not surprising for me. You could help. Uh, I've been by book from Baga brought, uh, yeah, 
uh, mercenaries. You need someone capable enough to do some. If you're in, you find in misty thicket. I can take you there. Wait, no, no! That ain't mean right now. I just wanted to find out more about Misty Thicket. How the hell am I going to get back now? <laughs> At least there's a map. Let's see what Bree Wall has to say. Aram Fay, okay. Zone Guide. Uh, I see one that says Misty Thicket. Current zone. Camp of Sucker. Plane. Okay, there's a Plane of Knowledge book there. All right. Oh, you're just a uh, so. I gotta forget. I gotta do that, and then I can do that. Statues. Do this. Level. 50. Ah, okay. This task begins in the Abyssal Sea. Alright, how about we do that another day? I need to find a bad guy here. Hopefully he's a good guy. I think they're guards, so I, it should be fine. Beast levels. Okay, let's see what the beast levels are here. Oh! Okay, they're all level 1. Not too shabby then. All right, but it's not going to help us gain levels, and that's what we got, got to do something today. So let's uh, let's head over to where the book is. Head back to the plane of knowledge. Go that way. All right, good. So thank God it's it's a, it's a low level here. Oh, I missed the book. It's back this way. Should be right around here somewhere. Oh, this way. Oh, there it is. There it is. There we go. I was about to say, come on, I got to enter here. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, that did lock up on me. Killing me here with that. All right. No, I am not offline. Okay. Hmm. So, where am I now? Oh, let's go back to default. Thank you. Uh, so we're up in the far corner here. All right, let's go. All right, we might as well just find this last guy here. Just see what he says. Not click on anything if he's going to take us there. Very important. All right, James the Watchmaker. Because we're not too far off. So let's go. Oh, did she do something to my hair? I just noticed. Oh, yeah, I guess she did. All right, let's see what he has. To... I have a feeling if we're... Well... I was about to say, I have a feeling he might take us to Halas, but the other guy was nowhere near wherever portal that was. All right, let's see what you... Oh, hail. I have the time. Uh, my time, not your time. Time you say, I usually keep a number of watches for me, so I, but I recently lost... Well, really, all of them. Also, I was traveling last week... Uh, and you know, 
that stuff to my loot, really. To look, I hate not knowing the time it is. I kind of do too. Okay, so he's got nothing. Nothing I can do. Okay, so let's uh, let's head off to the Blightfire Moors here and do some actual fighting here at some point today. So let's go find Zone Blightfire Moors, and then we can check. Uh, oh, that's right. I got to go to Crescent Reach to get to the Blightfire Moors. So like discombobulated I am today for God's sakes. All right, let's go. All right, gonna do some fighting now. After an hour and a half, we're, we're actually gonna get some action going here. That's the way, I mean, sometimes when I, when I log into Guild Wars, it's like inventory maintenance. Two hours. But, well, where did they go? <laughs> you know, it's like, frick, I was doing inventory maintenance for two hours. Alright, so now I can do tracking here to find stuff that I can actually track, which is where I can fight. I forgot what he said. A Blightfire Witch Lamp? Huh. It's interesting. What was that? Oh, somebody's running. Okay. Alright. Level 18, yeah, so they're all going to be, so Moss Viper, let me see tracking here, so I think, level 17, so red and yellow are a couple of levels ahead of me, how about this bog rat here? That's level 17. At least, this, all right, so let's get some experience here. So he's level 17. Uh, he's too far away. I, I did select you. How is he too far away? Do I, do I have to dismount? All right. Now, where'd he go? Uh, oh, you know what? Maybe I was... Oh, maybe I had the... Maybe I had the Viper still selected. Oh, Jesus. All right, we're just gonna have to melee this thing here. There we go. There we go. Melee. Thank you. Fizzles, come on. Do I have my thorns up? I don't think I have my thorns up. I have fizzles too. There we go. I 
I forgot about the potions. I just might feel like cat. Oh, you know what I do need to do? I need to do that. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Freaking kidding me. I gotta remember just to entangle these things before they have a chance to run away. Save some mana here for the Oh my god, are you see here comes the over aggro again. No. Over aggro! Look what we got, we have over aggro again. Am I hitting both of them? Yeah, it is hitting both of them. I'm not I'm not gonna be able to get them both down if Racina can't heal as fast. I don't have a heal, do I? No. Okay, I gotta run. Okay. I just gotta get out of here. Because I'm, I'm gonna die if I don't. What, what is that? Oh, Jesus, they're still there. Just kill them. I can't, Abs. I can't. They're going too fast. Stop bothering me. Go upstairs and clean. All right, there we go. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I killed a rat. I killed a rat today. <laughs> Got six. All right. Yeah, Abby trolling, who would have thought? Uh, who would have thought? <laughs> Happened again, yeah. Still looking for games. No, I pre uh, uh, for my 100 days, I've pretty much uh, got all the games wrapped up at this point. I'm just, um, I think, my, or my whole list wrapped up at this point. I actually have it in my Discord. Uh, I have it in my Discord channel under the um, stream schedule, I think. I, of course, I never remember to open Discord anymore uh, when I'm streaming. But, uh, yeah, I have the list there. Um, the only thing I'm actually waiting on to see if uh, the um, Tomb Raider games I still need go on sale before like I have them scheduled for October. Um, otherwise, I've got... Uh, otherwise, I'm just going to throw in... So it's only like... Uh, I think I only need like... I need Daddy. one, two, 
three. I think I need the four original. So I think I have five, six, and seven. I think there was seven. So I need the four original, and then the one that was uh, the the re the 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 re the last of the reboot trilogy that was released in September. Daddy, can you so five. Daddy, can you play the Kinos game again? This is the Kinos game. But um, yeah. See, every time, she, every time she just throws me off my train of thought here, especially today when I can't think straight anyway. Um, yeah. So it's just so. Uh, so combine with the other ones, it's like 10, 10 games I've got ready, ten or eleven, twelve, something like that. However many it is. Eight one. Somehow there is one that doesn't work. Look for Revolt. It's no older game. I had it on my Nintendo. Oh, wow, you did find it on the PC. Well, if it's in Steam, it'll probably be in Steam or uh, good old games, GOG. If it's in GOG, it'll be a little bit e earlier to, uh, easier to run. That's why I got, to, see, that, that, see, that's the problem I got now is that I, I have not been, I haven't had time. Let's put it this way. I haven't had time to try to get a virtual machine running on my new system here. And like all the older virtual machines don't work on it. I, I, I can't, they're not going to work. Because, you know, there are the, all there from Windows 7, the old Windows 7 virtual machine thing. And, of course, Windows 8 and 10 use Hyper-V, which, of course, makes them completely incompatible. Um, brilliant, Microsoft. Brilliant. Um, so whenever I... So what I'm trying to do now is try to port some of these old games, either to GOG. If they're DOS-based, I can actually get them to run in... in, in or not GOG, but uh, DOSBox. But some of the other ones, like uh, the Stronghold games and that kind of stuff, which are sort of the, the non-DOS games, but not quite the 3D games, I got to figure out how I'm going to get them to run. So at some point, I'm probably going to have to try to get a virtual machine set up on this thing and get them installed and see if they run. The problem is with Hyper-V, you don't get no sound and all this other nonsense. It's just a pain in the butt. Um... Yeah, so I got to figure out, I'm eventually probably going to have to end up picking up these games uh, either on Steam or through uh, GOG.com. Okay. The rats have abandoned us. All right, so let's go back here. It's, I don't think we've leveled up yet. I, I can't remember what my key bind is for this one now. Oh, it's inventory. It's just inventory. That's right. Oh, we did. We did. Yes. Okay. We did make level 16. All right. That did level us up. That's what I was hoping for. RC racing game. No, uh, no steam. Okay. Straight from the fan page. Okay. Yeah. I'll probably have problems running that then. Is the issue. Revolt race. Okay. Let me, uh. Let me do it here. Click it on this one makes it easy. Revolt race. Yeah, because it's it's fine, because I just I just checked my email yesterday. And apparently one of the the dirt rally game was on it was free on humble on the humble site for twenty four hours. And of course I don't see the email till after the sale's already over or to the free the free giveaways already over. I'm like, son of a gun. I do have a couple of racing Stop! I'm trying to talk. Don't interrupt. No, you can't have that. Because you're being annoying. But um Yeah, I do have a couple racing games scheduled for later on in hundred days of gaming. Radio control car racing. Oh really? Now that looks interesting. Now let me bookmark this. That way I can forget about it. <laughs> yeah, I'll have a bookmark thing and, and then forget about it anyway. There we go. Because um, now, of course, Firefox throws everything into this other bookmarks here. All right, so let me throw that there. That way I remember I can see that when I open up bookmarks. Yeah, see, the problem is it, with it being so old, my, I, I'll have to I'll have to research more and see. So I'm sure people have tried to get running on Windows 10 and stuff. So we'll have to look that up and uh, see. Because, yeah, that might be a good one to throw in. Because I think 
If I can't do Tomb Raider games, I am going to throw some classic games in there because I don't have a lot of classic games scheduled this year. Again, because, well, it's going to be a lot more problematic to try to uh, stream them or get, get them to run to begin with, let alone stream them. Okay, come on. Yeah, come on. Let's go. You. You I shall fight. Since you've already started attacking me. What are you? Level 18? Alright, this won't be a problem. Alright, let's get this. Let's get this thing. Because that's the thing too I'm gonna have to think about. Because next next year, what I kind of what I'm kind of thinking of doing for 100 days of gaming is to do um, like 75 new games, kind of like I've done this year and last year, completely different games I've never played before. 400 days of gaming, anyway, and then do like a top 25. So we'll do 75 new games and do a top 25 where I go back. And play my 25 most favorite games that I've played for the previous four years of 100 Days of Gaming. Which means, you know, we'll be we'll be playing Guild Wars again and, and so that kind of stuff. But some of it will be like the older classic games. So I'm gonna have to i I'm gonna at some point have to have to get at least a Windows XP machine up and running. I think if I can at least get Windows XP machine and it's more c compatible with Hyper-V. If, if I can get that. So I've already got, in fact, I've already got, I think I got one in, already in Hyper-V on my server. So I just got to port that to over here and see if I can get it to work on this machine. And if I can do that, then I can, like, install some of those older games on it and hopefully have a, uh, Hopefully have a better opportunity of playing some of my classic games again. Without having to rely on Steam or GOG.com. It's interrupted. That's what happened. You got interrupted. <laughs> yeah, Lineage 2 is definitely not going to be on that list. <laughs> It is not going to be on that list. See, my problem is, at first, when I first thought about it, it's like, well, am I actually going to be able to get 25 games out of it? Or am I going to have to stretch a little bit for what I consider our favorite games? But then I thought about it, it's like, off the top of my head, I have City Skylines. I have all three Guild Wars, because they are separate... They're separate and distinct games. Um, so I would be playing all three Guild Wars games. Um, you know, City Skylines. You know, the SimCity games. Uh, Two Point Hospital, which I played this year. Uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance, probably, I played this year. Shroud of the Avatar, I played this year. So I'm already, it's like already, it's like when I would, went through like the first, the first, you know, few games that popped in my head, it's like, well, that's already half the list. That's already my, half of my top 25. <laughs> now, of course, there's going to be games I can't play like Wildstar and Atlas Reactor because they've shut down. So they are no longer available. Um, what was it? Winning Putt. I liked Winning Putt. I think I did that for 100 Days of Gaming. Oh, I am stunned. Of course I'm stunned. So when the other one got down to about 25%, that's when it started running. So I've got to... I got to be... I got to save some mana here and be prepared to hit, uh, hit him with the Grasping Roots. So we don't run and aggro everything in sight again. All right, he's he's ensnared now. Let's see if we can get him down here. Oh, he's not ensnared. 
There we go. Now he's ensnared again. There we go. We got him. See, I don't... See, is this a quest? Quest? See, I don't know why I need Bog Rat Pelt 4. Do I need it? I don't think I need a Bog Rat Pelt for any quest. I need Orc Relics. But I'm not quite high enough level for that yet. Oh, you know what? I gotta go speak with Castian uh, uh, Drew. Where is he? I don't even remember where he's at. Oh, he, okay. He's in, so I do have to go back to... I forgot about that, actually. I completely forgot about that. Of course, I get a ring after I buy rings, but we'll see. If it's if it's an upgrade, we'll sell one of the ones I just bought for a loss. And if it's not, well, we'll just sell it and offset some of what... Uh, Greater Wisps. A uh, Nectalus Forest, okay. The Warrens. Yeah, see, everything takes me out of this area here. Okay. Let's see how we're doing on... Uh, it's 40%. So, yeah, a few more battles like this, we can get to level 17, which is sort of the key right now, so I can dual-wield those swords that uh, Peter gave me. Okay. Let's do some range. Up, oh, I was about to say, do some ranged attacks. Too late for that. Stop fizzling, for God's sakes. Oh, crap. I got no mana. I gotta save mana here. I need my potions. That's what I should do. I should uh, I should pop these potions here. This guy's gonna, he's gonna run away. I need... It's not that one. It's this one. Yep. Yep, there he goes. He's running. Hold on. He's running away. I don't think I have enough mana to hit him with this, do I? Nope. But hold on. So here we go. We're going over aggro again. Watch. I can't, what do you mean I can't see my target? Yeah, I have mana. That's what I thought. There we go. Got him. There we go. That helps. Ears. How lovely. So I don't necessarily want to pick up something I can't drop if I don't know if I'm going to need it or not. So it should be up here, right? So 30 minutes. Perfect. Looks here is speed. Or did I do speed instead of alacrity? I did this one, clarity, right? Healing. Healing. Health. Clarity 2. Robustness. Potion. Was this? Oh, lack. Okay. Yeah, okay. That was alacrity. Yeah, maybe I That's the attack speed. All right. Yeah, sometimes this stuff is confusing. All right. Let's go. Uh, let's go hit this thing here. Let's see what this guy is. Level 17. Yep. He's doable. Ah. 
Well, he's too close now. Melee him down. Where's he biting me? That's snow. That's. <laughs> Are you serious? That's where he's trying to attack me, right there. I'll be speaking in a high-pitched voice after this battle. <laughs> That's just so wrong. Well, one thing's for sure, I can't be playing this on the Extra Life for Kids channel. <laughs> oh my god, bog rat now, are you serious? Am I poisoned? I think she cured me, cured me of the poison anyway. I gotta hurry up and kill this thing so I can save Racina here. Right, she healed herself anyway, so that's right. I just gotta watch my mana and take care of her. Yeah, okay. Snake skin now. Alright. Let's fight this thing. Actually, you know what? I'll just do this a little bit, get some my archery going here. This Brasina seems to be holding her own. I am an archer after all. Be nice to be able to use my bow and arrow every once in a while. Oh my god, another one just spawned in here. Are you serious? You cannot be freaking serious. Oh, for God's sakes. The over aggro is real. All right, well, this is going to be an exercise in futility now. What level are you? Hold on. Ah, of course that's level 19. This is level 17, all right. Might actually be able to get out of this since he that one's attacking Brasina. Well, maybe not. Okay. All right, I got both of them there. All right, this so lightning strike will hit both of them. I just gotta watch my mana here. All right, this one's almost done. All right, there we go. A gold locket? Yeah, I already did the gold locket quest. I know that. Alright, there we go. Let's see if I can hit this thing now. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to melee here. Melee and spell this thing down because Brasina is on dire, dire ropes here. So if I don't get this thing down quite a bit... Oh, 
Alright, there he goes. He's focused on me now, so that'll, that'll work. Ah, the game is very serious. It's just like uh, when I was doing Wild Class, in fact, when I was doing Wild Class on Tuesday, I saw a chat. Uh, but I think it was on my Night Elf. Was it on my Night? I think it might have been on my Night Elf. Maybe, maybe it was uh, my. No, uh, well, regardless, whether it's my Night Elf or the other, or my Orc. Um. I saw some people uh, talking in chat about <laughs> about how just you know about mobs killing you that kind of stuff, and then one guy said, "Well, you know, right now it's like one one monster can kill you." You know, it's back in the glory days where you know nobody's buffed, and it was actually difficult to fight. The, you know, you had some difficult battles to fight. Christ, I knew it. Oh, melee. In fact, I had that. Yeah, this morning I play. I, I streamed this morning. Oh Jesus Christ! Here we go. All right, so I got. I got. Now nah, I'm just gonna run now. It's no point. M even m wasting the time to attack here. But yeah, even this morning, I ended up getting in a fight with like a level four spider or something like that uh, on my night elf who was level three, and <laughs> he got me, he got me down to half health. I was actually starting to worry whether I'd actually be able to beat the thing or not before I died. <laughs> and like nowadays, most you know most modern games nowadays, it's like you don't even think about that. You don't even worry about dying because it's like the battles don't even last long enough. You know, you don't even think about dying because it's so rare, and you know until you can get into the to some high end stuff. But here I am in the start level, and I'm like, oh my god, I'm gonna die, aren't I? All right, so where are we? Oh, oh, do we? Oh, we made level 17. Sweet. All right, that got us up to level 17. All right. Perfect. So now I should be able to do a wheel here. All right. We got our Pegasi. Oh, there it. Oh, you son of a. I did buy it. I was expecting it to go in this backpack. It went in that one. Oh. You're freaking killing me. I don't think I need this. This is... Oh, I don't even think I can use this, can I? Uh, Necro, Wizard, Mage, and uh, whatever um, ENC is. So, not Ranger. So, I can't use that. So, I guess all that stuff. I got to go back to the Plane of Knowledge anyway. So, we'll do that. Because I actually got to get to the Extra Life for Kids channel in a little bit here. But, yeah. It's... You know, it's... Well, how many times have I died playing this game so far? We started, what, back in January? We're at, what, what now, this uh, this stream is going to be episodes, what, 29 and 30? So, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, how many times have I died? I died in the glooming deep mines like three or four times, for God's sakes. Now, these are the glory, these are back in the glory days, man. Alright, so... I should, he said, I should have a skill now of dual wield. Yes, there it is. There it is. Excellent. All right, so now I should be able to take this and then throw these guys in here. Yes. There we go. We can dual wield now. Sweet. All right, so we can start working on leveling that skill up. I gotta go see. I I gotta go see my guild master, so I'm sure I can level that up a bit for free. Uh, 
I wonder if there's guild masters in the plane of knowledge. I don't remember. Well, we got something accomplished in, the, uh, in these two hours. <laughs> something. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I don't... See, if I end up needing that stuff, I'm just gonna end up fighting them anyway. The good old XP grind, baby. The good old XP grind. The wonderful days of wizardry. So I'd want to battle now, but I really I gotta get I gotta get prepped here for uh for extra life for kids channel. Yeah, those were the days back then, yep. Yeah, I, yeah, I gotta. So we'll we'll be doing some fighting next week. We'll be leveling up. I, I gotta get some quests on. That's the thing I gotta do here. So maybe, maybe we can find one of these areas here that will be a little bit more on par for our level, and we might be able to. Uh, clear out some quests. So let's get the plane of knowledge. At least get uh, the Scouting Black Burrow done. And then we'll be off to the Extra Life for Kids channel. And uh, we'll be back with EQ2 next week. And more oh my god, Antonica. <laughs> I've been in, in Antonica for at least half the, half the episodes, I think, so far. Alright, let's uh Mailed up anyway. I'm gonna have to reorganize my backpacks to make it more logical or something. Like, can I? Description. Can I? Ch see, I'm. I'm just curious if I can change. Rename backpacks or something, or even. It's like even with Guild Wars, you can actually die your bags and stuff. Not that it matters, but... See, fine, I would just have to look. It's just, you know, I don't know. Oh, I'm gonna do that. There we go. Get remounted here. And we need to find Castellan Drew. So let's see if he comes up here. Yep, there he is. Track. Uh, straight ahead. Okay. To the right. Behind. So is he right here? Behind and to the right. Oh, there he is. Oh, yeah. Okay. He's the armor quest, dude. Okay. Let's hail. Completed. Oh, wow. Look, we did actually complete the quest. Excellent. So let's see what we got here. You know what? I gotta sell stuff now, too. So let's see what this is here. So this is 4, 5. Mana, 5. Endurance, 5. So we might be able to trade off 4. Yeah, maybe not. Yeah, see, these are still... Damn, I, I got 10 fingers. I want to wear the ring now. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> let's uh, go find the merch here. Oh, let's this back. We got our map pack, which helps. Yeah, right in here. Okay, that's what I thought. He won't buy it back? Oh, you're killing me. You are freaking killing me. Or he won't buy it. Oh, that's not bad. A plat for that? Alright. Two plat? Alright. Silver. Get three silver out of that. Snake egg, five copper. 
What do we got? There's the bog rat tail, five copper. Okay. All right, so let me go back to the other guy then. Uh, he was, they were right around here, weren't they? Items, yeah, that's him. Oh, now, he bought back the other one, I think. Buy it back. Frippin' kidding me. He won't buy any of this back. <sighs> oh, he doesn't even want that, huh? All right. Whatever. Whatever. All right. So we'll see. We'll see about, uh, maybe we'll do the desert crawl or something next week. If uh, We'll see. We'll, we'll look for these areas and see what's uh, kind of on level here. Oh, I got it. Cancel that. Thank you. Uh, let's head back over here. All right, so I was about to say, where's my uh, crescent reach stone? There it is. All right. So thank you for joining me today, everyone. Much, much appreciated, as always, for our ever-questing Monday. Can I wave on here? Well, it says I wave, but I don't really wave. That's okay. <laughs> our Pegasus will wave when we run forward. Watch. See, he's waving. He's waving to you. My Pegasi. My Pegasi is waving to you. Thank you for watching, everyone. Ever-questing Monday. We do every Monday. Around about 12.30 to 2.30, you know, depending on real life and how late I am doing my other streams. But uh, much appreciated, everybody, joining me. Remember, follows are free. If you like what you see here, give us a follow. You can be notified. I usually turn notifications off because <laughs> sometimes it can just be a pain in the ass how many emails you get with that. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, thanks for hanging out. Kat and Taz and everybody else out there. And, uh, of course, all the lurkers. As always, I enjoy lurkers. Much appreciated. Hope you guys enjoy the show as you're lurking. It is always much appreciated. And uh, we'll see everybody again next week, like I said, for EverQuest 2. Of course, we'll be back here in two weeks for the original EverQuest and having some fun. Fun back in the good old days. Uh, in the meantime, I've got to pop on over to the Extra Life for Kids channel. We're going to do a little indie game uh, called Cook, Serve, Delicious 2. You may have heard of it pretty fun game i've enjoyed it and uh they've got cook serve delicious three that is uh in development right now uh extra i can my brain my brain my brain my poor brain extra i forget so we'll be there in just a few minutes as we uh get set up and uh get ready for that stream and then uh i'll catch everybody uh, the rest of the week, again, uh, current stream schedule is uh, down below the live stream window. And you can also check out our Discord uh, for that, as well as our uh, list for 100 Days of Gaming games uh, that we'll be playing for the next, uh, where are we, day 41 today? So we've got uh, 59 more games and 59 more days to go with that. So you can check out, see if there's any games that you're particularly interested in watching. And uh, be sure to be there on that day. On Chow Real Millennium Group. But thanks for watching, everyone. Much, much appreciated. I'm gonna gonna cut out. And like I said, we'll be over at the Extra Life for Kids channel in a uh, in just about uh, probably about 10 minutes or so. If you want to head over there and uh, continue to hang out and lurk away. It's much appreciated. Until next time, everyone, I am BJ Waller, and I will see you in game.